In order to do things with our code, we're going to need some sort of editor. I'm going to use Visual Studio Code. You're welcome to use whichever one you want. I have it right here under the recently searched Visual Studio Code. And then you can go to the download. There we go, Visual Studio Code. And I'm using the Windows one. I'm not going to walk through the download because it's pretty straightforward. So once you get Visual Studio Code, you can bring it up, we'll go to the search. And you can type on it or type, look for it. Visual Studio Code. There we go. All right, my Visual Studio Code is opened up. I am in dark mode. You can play around with the settings if you want dark mode or light mode, whichever. Let's go to File. I'm going to open the folder and I'm under my base directory. I should have the Bigfoot in here. Here it is, Bigfoot. We're going to select folder and there we go. So, if this didn't open up for you, you're going to have your Bigfoot base directory. Then you're going to have source. A lot of your stuff is in the source and the things that most people are familiar with is the index.html, right? I already opened it up. So I have our HTML. Uh, the only thing really interesting in here for changing, I mean, other than this, we're going to get into that stuff later is, well, not much later is the title is, this is the part that's up on the tab, right? So if I go Bigfoot, hunter do a control s now i still have my ng serve running right right here i haven't changed anything with that if we go over to our website it says bigfoot hunter it updated it updated uh because ng serve was already running all right and you're going to get more familiar with that let's go ahead and take a look at the code some more um, right here under app, this is where most of your stuff is going to happen. Um, we're going to do, we're going to create components and we're going to put those components on this app component right here. Let's open up app component.html or app.component.html. We got a lot of stuff in there. No, I don't want to do that. We got a lot of stuff in there. What happens if we delete this? Let's take a look at our website real quick. Boom. This is what we have now on our website. Let's go over here. Let's go down to the bottom. That's huge. Hundreds of lines long. We need this router outlet. So keep that. I'm going to click right above it. I'm going to take my little scroll bar, go to the top. Shift, click, delete. So we deleted everything but this. And I might move it even up to the top line. I'm gonna do a control S to save. Let's go back to our website, or we can take a look at our ng serve, see what's happening there. Up, oh, compiled successfully, it was quick. Look at that, nothing in it. We got rid of everything but that router stuff. That's pretty cool. So this is where you should be, you should have this blank page. If you got lost, the only thing we really did that matters in this uh, in this video is the app.component.html. We deleted everything but the router outlet, right? And that is under source app, app.component.html.